Hi, I'm Debbie Birch, and I'm with the Queen Anne's County Office of Tourism, and we're here today to talk about the Two Rivers bike ride, which is coming up the end of this month, and I have Myron and Meredith here from the Y River Upper School to tell us all about it. I'm Myron Richardson. I'm on the Board of Trustees at Y River Upper School. All right. I am Meredith Dean. I am a sophomore. I go to Y River Upper School. And you're the student, one of the student um, in charge of this this year. <laughs> we have a we have a bike committee. Yep, and we have we two go. students uh, serving on the bike committee. Very good, very good. So this is the third annual um, one of these bike rides. So tell us a little bit about what the bike ride is to start with, and then we'll find out who benefits from the the money that's made and the sponsors and all that. So. Where is it? Where's well, the bike, the, the bike ride is a fundraiser for Y River Upper School and the Corsica River Conservancy, two okay. agencies actually. It takes place right here in Queen Anne's County and part of Kent County. And uh, it gives uh, serious bikers an opportunity to go to a new route where they know they're going to have support. But we also uh, have short rides for That's, uh, I'm smiling bikers. and I'm laughing because I'm thinking serious bikers. So so what are the distances we're talking about for the serious and then the non-serious everyday biker, you know, weekend warriors? Um, we have a 15-mile one. We have a 30-mile one. We have a 65, and then we Whoa. have an 100. Whoa. And how, lo how long does it usually take somebody, like, I guess the, the big bike riders are the ones that do the, the, the big length of the uh, routes. How long does it take to do that? A serious rider uh, can average 18 to 20 miles an hour. And so it's uh, six hours or so for a 100-mile okay. uh, ride. And the 65 miles is a metric century. 65 miles is 100 kilometers. Okay. And so most of the serious people will ride those two. Cheesy peasy. And, and you know, you think the eastern shore is flat, but there are some hills. <laughs> so so um, do people get sponsorships to ride in this, or how does it work? How do you guys make your money from this event? We sell sponsorships to the okay. local uh uh, businesses, mm -hmm. but we also have a fundraising opportunity uh, when people sign up, okay. they can uh, raise money also. Okay. So it's from those two. How many people usually ride for this? Is it, you know, 100? Is it 500? Last year we had 300? 300. Had 300 Whoa. last year. Okay. Uh, I'm hoping for 500 this year, but uh, we already have 230 roughly okay, signed up for this year. It's so. June 28th, so you still have like mm -hmm. four weeks to go, four and a half weeks. So when they're riding along the routes, are there like water stations? Do they st are there places to stop? And I have to ask, are there like porta pots? You know, I'm, I'm asking the important stuff. Water and bathrooms. How is it like? You know, I guess you have support teams along the way. We have. Uh, um, there's at least one food place okay. during the 15. I didn't even think about food. <laughs> um, we, we, last year we had like bagels with peanut butter mm -hmm. and um, we might have, we also had oranges. Okay. So we also had water as well. Okay. There are a total of seven stops. All right. And so we have six vehicles that will ride the route. That so that anyone has, has difficulty or decides they took on more than they could handle, okay. we can pick them up and bring them back. All right. And what time do they start in the morning? Um, they can start at 6.30, but um, if you don't want to get up that early, then you can start any time in between that and 10. 10. Okay. So so then they're pretty much finishing up by, you know, dinner time-ish around Yeah, because it's not much of a competition ride. Okay. So we don't have a designated time. Out of curiosity, the shorter ride for the people who may not be as experienced, where does that take you? Is that just like around Centerville or, and, and where does everybody start from? Everybody. Uh, everyone starts at the courthouse. Okay. And the 15 mile goes down Watson Road to Spaniard Nake okay. and comes back around uh, to the courthouse. Okay, that's a nice scenic, that's, that's not a bad route. The 30-mile goes up as far as uh, Churchill. All right. 
yep. and the there's, six to five there's some mile, hills there i'm thinking of the hill yeah, on 213. <laughs> six to five mile uh, goes to millington down to tuckahoe and back okay and the 100 mile puts in a loop up to betterton beach oh my gosh so uh, <laughs> wow and do you have a lot of people that do the big one yes most people will do either the 65 or 100. okay and who are some of your sponsors this year that you have Mm -hmm. Let's see, the gold would be the town of Centerville and in Crete of Maryland. Okay. The silver is the rough roofers. Okay. The bronze will be the willow construction. Awesome. Okay. And um, I know there was one other name in here. Um, honorary co-chairs this year. Um, are Brian and Kim Billick. Okay, so a little bit of celebrity there. Right. Awesome. Well, hopefully, you know, you'll have good weather. Is there a rain date for this, or is it that day and that's it? That's it. That's it. Okay. Rain or shine. <laughs> so everybody needs to come out. So it's Saturday, June 28th, and um, we have contact information up on the screen, uh, website and um, phone number, and it's to benefit the Y Upper School. Um, and you all are in a transition period or getting ready to make a move, I believe, right? You're currently at the Chesapeake College and you're mm -hmm. getting ready to, well, I don't know how quick, but the armory, armory here in Centerville is being renovated and going to be the new, your new home here. When um, are we moving in, Martin? September something. Of this year? September of this year. Wow. Okay. That's awesome. The The building looks great. It just, you know, when you ride by, you see all the construction and it, they've done a beautiful job with it. So that's exciting. So awesome. All right. Well, hopefully, you know, we'll get a lot of people. It's going to be a good day that day and everybody will finish the roots, right. <laughs> whatever ones they pick. So thank you guys for coming in. Well, thank you for thank having you. us. You're welcome.